Hello everybody, my name is Jeff Fulbright. I'm the Director of Development for Black Knight and manage the team of developers behind the Paragon suite of products. For those of you that do not know me, I'll be celebrating my 20th year this year in real estate technology. I started right out of college at a company called Homeseekers.com, working on one of the first internet-based MLS platforms called XMLS Web. And then I've transitioned over the years to working on Paragon, as well as our LAMPS Association Management product. What I plan on covering today is Paragon's open MLS suite of products and APIs that are truly powered by RESO standards. I plan on walking you through a quick slideshow of what open MLS can do and then provide a quick demo. Before I move over to the slide deck, I just wanted to give Sam and the RESO team some kudos for quickly pivoting to a virtual event. And I truly hope the current situation takes a drastic turn for the better and we're able to meet face to face at an, at an event later this year. I truly hope everyone is staying safe and doing well in the current work from home environment and I hope to see you all soon. What is Paragon OpenMLS? It's a comprehensive solution that allows Paragon customers to better manage access to their MLS data. It allows MLSs to meet the evolving needs of their brokers, agents, and third-party vendors that support them. OpenMLS is built directly into the Paragon application. It is not a separate platform where data is migrated from one solution to another. The products that consist of OpenMLS are the Data Dictionary Translator, Data Dictionary Visual Mapper, the Paragon Reso Web API that ties those two together, as well as the Comma Data Management Dashboard and the third-party integration framework. The Data Dictionary Visual Mapper allows MLS staff to map your native data format to the Reso Data Dictionary standard. You have the capability to rename fields, convert data types, write formulas, and map lookup values to their Data Dictionary counterparts. If you have a field named type of fence, but data dictionary requires fence type, then that data can be easily mapped accordingly. Formulas can be used to split or combine data fields. If for some reason bathrooms were stored in a decimal format where full and partial baths was in one field, then this tool can be used to, to allow you to split that field and map the data to the two separate integer fields, total and partial. You are able to map 100% of your native data so none of your local fields will be missing from your feeds. You can also store an unlimited number of mappings, and they can be easily copied from one to another. If you had just completed your, your Data Dictionary 1.6 mapping and 1.7 was just released, then you can easily copy all the pertaining fields over and get a good head start. Paragon then utilizes these maplings to dynamically convert your data on the fly when requested by third-party vendors. What that means is, is all the feeds you've set up over the years, all the payloads you, you've identified and security attached, are now, when they are consumed via the Web API, all of those payloads are now, in real time, converted to a data dictionary format. Both of these utilities allow you to support Data Dictionary without impacting your members. Your input forms and business rules remain unaffected, while the data can come out of Paragon in a RESO standard format. This will allow you to transition your native schema and forms at your own pace over time in, instead of having a hard cutover that impacts all of your members at once. Paragon's native Visa Web API works directly. Right now, the payloads that are, are the resources that are su supported at OpenMLS consist of properties, members, offices, media, and contacts. Save searches, prospecting data. In that resource, you'll be able to get things like favorites, possible rejected, also any communication and comments you've had back and forth with your buyers and sellers. We currently also support open house and tours. In the last few weeks, due to the current situation going on, we've also added the capability to add live stream events to those resources as well. Brokers can pull all the data they need to power their back office and leads management applications. And all of the data currently coming out is under complete control of the MLS. All of the restrictions and security they've uh, applied over the years all remains coming out of the Web API.
Paragon and OpenMLS also currently supports listing input via API. This allows third-party platforms such as forms, mobile apps, and brokerage platforms to edit and add new listings via an API. It supports the full set of MLS business rules to ensure data accuracy and compliance. Paragon currently has customers where more than 70% of their listings are added by outside applications. Our third-party integration platform, currently engineered to be extremely flexible, proven integration framework, it supports over 120 plus third-party vendors today provides SSO and secure data access, allowing end users to seamlessly transition from Paragon to authorized third-party platforms. Brokers util also utilizing our Paragon for Brokers platform can have integrations that are specific to their business and platforms. The P4B platform also supports custom broker fields that will be available to come through OpenMOS as well to power their back office feeds. So who in the end benefits from all this? Currently, Black Knight benefits greatly. We now have the capability to have data dictionary feeds for our customers that can more easily allow us to do cross-platform searching and accommodate data shares. The MLS has complete control of data format and access. They no longer have to wait for a vendor to make any changes. They go in, change the mapping, and it is immediately available in the Web API. Brokers have access to custom fields and an expanded data set. And also vendors are getting a data dictionary payload, as well as to be able to easily integrate with the Paragon application. I'm now gonna turn the presentation over to Jarrett Robeson, who's my lead architect on OpenMLS, to provide a quick demo of the data dictionary mapping utility, as well as the web API. We're going to talk briefly about Paragon's native web API. Let's first take a look at the data systems resource. This will tell us which versions of data dictionary are supported by the system and which resources may be available. As you can see on this particular system, we have data dictionary 1.7, 1.6, 1.8, 1.9, 1.10, 1.11, 1.12, 1.13, 1.14, 1.15, 1.16, 1.17, 1.18, 1.19, 1.20, 1.21, 1.22, 1.23, 1.24, 1.25, 1.26, 1.27, 1.28, 1.29, 1.30, 1.31, 1.32, 1.33, 1.34, 1.35, 1.36, 1.37, 1.38, 1.39, 1.40, 1.41, 1.42, 1.43, 1.44, 1.45, 1.46, 1.47, 1.48, 1.49, 1.50, 1.51, 1.52, 1.53, 1.54, 1.55, 1.56, 1.57, 1.58, 1.59, 1.60, 1.61, 1.62, 1.63, 1.64, 1.65, 1.66, 1.67, 1.68, 1.69, 1.70, 1.71, 1.72, 1.73, 1.74, 1.75, 1.76, 1.77, 1.78, 1.79, 1.80, 1.81, 1.82, 1.83, 1.84, 1.85, 1.86, 1.87, 1.88, 1.89, 1.90, 1.91, 1.92, 1.93, 1.94, 1.95, 1.96, 1.97, 1.98, 1.99, 1.10, 1.11, 1.12, 1.13, 1.14, 1.15, 1.16, 1.17, 1.18, 1.19, 1.20, 1.21, 1.22, 1.23, 1.24, 1.25, 1.26, 1.27, 1.28, 1.29, 1.30, 1.31, 1.32, 1.33, 1.34, 1.35, 1.36, 1.37, 1.38, 1.39, 1.40, 1.41, 1.42, 1.43, 1.44, 1.45, 1.46, 1.47, 1.48, 1.49, 1.50, 1.51, 1.52, 1.53, 1.54, 1.55, 1.56, 1.57, 1.58, 1.59, 1.60, 1.61, 1.62, 1.63, 1.64, 1.65, 1.66, 1.67, 1.68, 1.69, 1.70, 1.71, 1.72, 1.73, 1.74, 1.75, 1.76, 1.77, 1.78, 1.79, 1.80, 1.81, 1.82, 1.83, 1.84, 1.85, 1.86, 1.87, 1.88, 1.89, 1.90, 1.91, 1.92, 1.93, 1.94, 1.95, 1.96, 1.97, 1.98, 1.99, 1.10, 1.11, 1.12, 1.13, 1.14, 1.15, 1.16, 1.17, 1.18, 1.19, 1.20, 1.21, 1.22, 1.23, 1.24, 1.25, 1.26, 1.27, 1.28, 1.29, 1.30, 1.31, 1.32, 1.33, 1.34, 1.35, 1.36, 1.37, 1.38, 1.39, 1.40, 1.41, 1.42, 1.43, 1.44, 1.45, 1.46, 1.47, 1.48, 1.49, 1.50, 1.51, 1.52, 1.53, 1.54, 1.55, 1.56, 1.57, 1.58, 1.59, 1.60, 1.61, 1.62, 1.63, 1.64, 1.65, 1.66, 1.67, 1.68, 1.69, 1.70, 1.71, 1.72, 1.73, 1.74, 1.75, 1.76, 1.77, 1.78, 1.79, 1.80, 1.81, 1.82, 1.83, 1.84, 1.85, 1.86, 1.87, 1.88, 1.89, 1.90, 1.91, 1.92, 1.93, 1.94, 1.95, 1.96, 1.97, 1.98, 1.99, 1.10, 1.11, 1.12, 1.13, 1.14, 1.15, 1.16, 1.17, 1.18, 1.19, 1.20, 1.21, 1.22, 1.23, 1.24, 1.25, 1.26, 1.27, 1.28, 1.29, 1.30, 1.31, 1.32, 1.33, 1.34, 1.35, 1.36, 1.37, 1.38, 1.39, 1.40, 1.41, 1.42, 1.43, 1.44, 1.45, 1.46, 1.47, 1.48, 1.49, 1.50, 1.51, 1.52, 1.53, 1.54, 1.55, 1.56, 1.57, 1.58, 1.59, 1.60, 1.61, 1.62, 1.63, 1.64, 1.65, 1.66, 1.67, 1.68, 1.69, 1.70, 1.71, 1.72, 1.73, 1.74, 1.75, 1.76, 1.77, 1.78, 1.79, 1.80, 1.81, 1.82, 1.83, 1.84, 1.85, 1.86, 1.87, 1.88, 1.89, 1.90, 1.91, 1.92, 1.93, 1.94, 1.95, 1.96, 1.97, 1.98, 1.99, 1.10, 1.11, 1.12, 1.13, 1.14, 1.15, 1.16, 1.17, 1.18, 1.19, 1.20, 1.21, 1.22, 1.23, 1.24, 1.25, 1.26, 1.27, 1.28, 1.29, 1.30, 1.31, 1.32, 1.33, 1.34, 1.35, 1.36, 1.37, 1.38, 1.39, 1.40, 1.41, 1.42, 1.43, 1.44, 1.45, 1.46, 1.47, 1.48, 1.49, 1.50, 1.51, 1.52, 1.53, 1.54, 1.55, 1.56, 1.57, 1.58, 1.59, 1.60, 1.61, 1.62, 1.63, 1.64, 1.65, 1.66, 1.67, 1.68, 1.69, 1.70, 1.71, 1.72, 1.73, 1.74, 1.75, 1.76, 1.77, 1.78, 1.79, 1.80, 1.81, 1.82, 1.83, 1.84, 1.85, 1.86, 1.87, 1.88, 1.89, 1.90, 1.91, 1.92, 1.93, 1.94, 1.95, 1.96, 1.97, 1.98, 1.99, 1.10, 1.11, 1.12, 1.13, 1.14, 1.15, 1.16, 1.17, 1.18, 1.19, 1.20, 1.21, 1.22, 1.23, 1.24, 1.25, 1.26, 1.27, 1.28, 1.29, 1.30, 1.31, 1.32, 1.33, 1.34, 1.35, 1.36, 1.37, 1.38, 1.39, 1.40, 1.41, 1.42, 1.43, 1.44, 1.45, 1.46, 1.47, 1.48, 1.49, 1.50, 1.51, 1.52, 1.53, 1.54, 1.55, 1.56, 1.57, 1.58, 1.59, 1.60, 1.61, 1.62, 1.63, 1.64, 1.65, 1.66, 1.67, 1.68, 1.69, 1.70, 1.71, 1.72, 1.73, 1.74, 1.75, 1.76, 1.77, 1.78, 1.79, 1.80, 1.81, 1.82, 1.83, 1.84, 1.85, 1.86, 1.87, 1.88, 1.89, 1.90, 1.91, 1.92, 1.93, 1.94, 1.95, 1.96, 1.97, 1.98, 1.99, 1.10, 1.11, 1.12, 1.13, 1.14, 1.15, 1.16, 1.17, 1.18, 1.19, 1.20, 1.21, 1.22, 1.23, 1.24, 1.25, 1.26, 1.27, 1.28, 1.29, 1.30, 1.31, 1.32, 1.33, 1.34, 1.35, 1.36, 1.37, 1.38, 1.39, 1.40, 1.41, 1.42, 1.43, 1.44, 1.45, 1.46, 1.47, 1.48, 1.49, 1.50, 1.51, 1.52, 1.53, 1.54, 1.55, 1.56, 1.57, 1.58, 1.59, 1.60, 1.61, 1.62, 1.63, 1.64, 1.65, 1.66, 1.67, 1.68, 1.69, 1.70, 1.71, 1.72, 1.73, 1.74, 1.75, 1.76, 1.77, 1.78, 1.79, 1.80, 1.81, 1.82, 1.83, 1.84, 1.85, 1.86, 1.87, 1.88, 1.89, 1.90, 1.91, 1.92, 1.93, 1.94, 1.95, 1.96, 1.97, 1.98, 1.99, 1.10, 1.11, 1.12, 1.13, 1.14, 1.15, 1.16, 1.17, 1.18, 1.19, 1.20, 1.21, 1.22, 1.23, 1.24, 1.25, 1.26, 1.27, 1.28, 1.29, 1.30, 1.31, 1.32, 1.33, 1.34, 1.35, 1.36, 1.37, 1.38, 1.39, 1.40, 1.41, 1.42, 1.43, 1.44, 1.45, 1.46, 1.47, 1.48, 1.49, 1.50, 1.51, 1.52, 1.53, 1.54, 1.55, 1.56, 1.57, 1.58, 1.59, 1.60, 1.61, 1.62, 1.63, 1.64, 1.65, 1.66, 1.67, 1.68, 1.69, 1.70, 1.71, 1.72, 1.73, 1.74, 1.75, 1.76, 1.77, 1.78, 1.79, 1.80, 1.81, 1.82, 1.83, 1.84, 1.85, 1.86, 1.87, 1.88, 1.89, 1.90, 1.91, 1.92, 1.93, 1.94, 1.95, 1.96, 1.97, 1.98, 1.99, 1.10, 1.11, 1.12, 1.13, 1.14, 1.15, 1.16, 1.17, 1.18, 1.19, 1.20, 1.21, 1.22, 1.23, 1.24, 1.25, 1.26, 1.27, 1.28, 1.29, 1.30, 1.31, 1.32, 1.33, 1.34, 1.35, 1.36, 1.37, 1.38, 1.39, 1.40, 1.41, 1.42, 1.43, 1.44, 1.45, 1.46, 1.47, 1.48, 1.49, 1.50, 1.51, 1.52, 1.53, 1.54, 1.55, 1.56, 1.57, 1.58, 1.59, 1.60, 1.61, 1.62, 1.63, 1
refresh the screen. And we can see that basement is still properly populated, or it should be. And now when we scroll down, we can see that basement field that used to be empty now displays the word none. Let's map one more field so we can get a feel for how value mapping is handled. In this case, we're going to map the cooling feature in Data Dictionary to the cooling feature in Paragon. Drag and drop. And that's mapped our fields. And we can immediately head over and take a look at our search results to see the changes. Okay. Looking pretty good. And if we go back and look at the value mapping, we can see that Paragon was able to map most of our fields from Paragon to Data Dictionary automatically. There are a couple of fields that it couldn't map. So why don't we try to find a home for those? We'll map C remarks to other. And we'll map wall slash window units to window units. Okay, and now we have every field in Paragon, every value in Paragon mapped correctly to Data Dictionary. And when we go back and look at our results, we can see that cooling is, is has been properly mapped and is displaying for every result. Let's refine this query just a bit more here. I'm seeing a lot of single family residents, but maybe I don't want those. So let me filter my results. And I'm gonna say I want properties that don't equal single family residents. And now I'm getting manufactured homes, condominiums, and so forth. And further, why don't I order these results so I get the newest things on top? <clears throat> okay, <clears throat> and now we see we have the latest listings on top because I am now ordering by listing key numeric. All right, and this concludes our short demo of the Paragon Web API.